Hi folks, Thomas Henson here with thomashenson.com and today is another episode of Big Data, Big Questions. And so today's question comes in from a user and it's all about, okay, what specific master's degree should I get? So find out how I answer this question and what master's degree you should get or should not get if you're going into data engineering. So today's question, if you have a question, make sure you put it in the comment section here below. Reach out to me on thomashenson.com forward slash big questions. Find me on Twitter, whatever you want to do, and I'll do my best to answer your questions right here. So today's question, so I'm looking for a career as a data engineer, but I've got a bachelor's in IT and I'm looking to get into a master's degree. Awesome, congratulations. It's a pretty cool thing to go through. I went through a master's program as well. Um, which is better for a data engineering career, thinking about that specifically, a master's degree in data science or a master's degree in computer science? So this question for me, you know, kind of really keys, right? Like I remember what it was like going through when I'm trying to figure out which kind of master's I wanted to go to. I had a similar situation, um, specifically wasn't in the uh, data engineering uh, from that perspective, but I was looking in to see, okay, what do I want to do to take the next level uh, in my engineering career? And I looked at a MBA with an emphasis in information systems versus a you know master in science, uh, computer science. I ended up choosing to continue on um, down the business path and getting my MBA in information systems. Pretty excited to have gone through that uh, and really happy with my decision. I, I feel like it's been fortunate with my career. So I understand where you're coming from. I'm not telling you to get an MBA, that's not what I'm saying. I understand how much you kind of look going back and forth and you're like, man, which, what, do I, what do I do here? So I appreciate you asking for my, my opinion as well. So which one should you get if you're going into a data engineering? I mean, it's an easy um, guess for me here just to say, hey, I think computer science and the skills that are involved in computer science are gonna help. So if I were, if I were in your shoes, I would look and pivot more towards the computer science. I would look into though, there are new universities and other programs that are starting to emerge that actually have a data engineering uh, track. So just like you were asking about, you know, should I do the data science? You know, in, in my opinion, if you're not trying to go down the data science path, maybe you maybe don't kind of go in into that. If they do have a track specific for data engineers, so data science is a newer program a lot of universities and colleges are having, you know, around the globe. So if they have a specific data engineering path, I'd look into that, but specifically, I'd probably stay with the computer science uh, track. However, like I said, there are some universities that are putting out a specific, this is not data science, but a specific data engineering pack where you're going to go through, you know, more systems administration stuff where you're going to be building out programs that are going to analyze data um, and being able to really focus on distributed systems, whether it be, you know, from Kubernetes and containers, you know, to different clouds, right? Like knowing how to do it in AWS, building out da good data pipelines and really understanding what you're doing from that perspective. So I think I'd look into that and also make sure you're looking at some of those degrees. So one more bonus tip around as you're going through that, I would definitely, you know, at the university that you're looking at, have a conversation with some advisors and even some of the professors in the data science world or you know in the computer engineering world and see if you can cross over, right? So maybe there's an opportunity there to do something interdisciplinary. So maybe you can take a couple of the data science courses because they would be really good for you to get exposure to it, not become a data science, but exposure to what goes on on the data science side and have those packaged together and go through some of those courses while you're going through the computer science course. So maybe they, you know, not asking you to take double load. Hopefully, you know, there's, there's a crossover there where it's like, Hey, I can pick and choose some of these because with data engineering and just the boom that's going on with that as far as careers. And I mean, if you look at just globally, we need more data engineers. I think the universities would be pretty excited uh, for, especially somebody standing out to do that. And worst case scenario, what are they going to do? Your professors may tell you no, but they see that you're engaged and that you're interested in data engineering. So they're going to be on the lookout for, you know, maybe there's new classes that are coming up. But what about internships, right? Like some of these universities have really good relationships with corporations. So your name is already at the top of the list and it's shown that you're showing initiative that, hey, I'm excited about the data engineering uh, world. So any opportunities to learn more or any opportunities for future career growth might be a good thing. So... You know, something as simple as taking an hour to reach out and talk to a professor may, you know, maybe investing in yourself and in your career uh, for further on down the future. So definitely try that out. 
So should you get a master's degree to become a data engineer? You don't have to, but you know, like I said, I've got a master's degree and I kind of went through that for my own purposes. So, you know, if you're watching this video and you've made it all the way to the end, which I hope you've made it to the end, everybody, everybody that starts watching it, um, this was a specific question where we were talking about, you know, different degree options uh, for your career. So we're not saying that you have to get, you know, the mat, you know, master in computer science to become a data engineer. Heck, you can even go through and do the data, master in data science and become a data engineer. This is just my advice for what we're trying to do. And there are other data engineers that don't have degrees. So we've covered that quite a few bit on this channel. And so I just want to be specific to that. I don't want people watching this course, especially like if you're in college or if you're in high school and you're starting to you know think about your data engineering path, and you're like, oh man, I've got to go get a master's degree to do this. Maybe it's in a long haul. That's not what we're talking about here. We're just talking about options, right? So let me know if you have any questions about degrees, certifications, anything you know, data engineering or technology specific, and I will answer it in the next episode of Big Data, Big Questions.